Alexa, read my notifications. One new notification from Amazon Shopping. A shipment has arrived. Hello, shopping addicts. Today I'll be unboxing the microphone that I purchased. Made in China, USB mic. <laughs> says YouTube on here too. So it's open here. So I guess this is it. It's a very generic box. Like I was saying, a lot of these cheap things you're getting from uh, Amazon with these weird names, PI, PI, painting. Which name does, actually doesn't make sense, but oh well. Um, these are probably white label products coming from Asia. Yeah, there's there's nothing in here about uh, contacting customer service or anything. And outside of the name being right here, it's nowhere else. So let's look. Inside, you have the white foam, you have a US, oh this is an old USB connector, huh? Oh, metal tripod, very simple tripod. Looks like there's only, well, I guess you can have it stand like this. It's a little wobbly, or maybe not. Or out like this. Maybe some in between. All right, let's see if there's anything else. Nothing in that one. Here's the mic itself. Has a volume knob. I don't know if it. I don't feel any clicking. And when I press it, I do feel a little bit of something, but I don't know if it's just some play. Looks like it has a LED light in the name here. The thread. Oh. So this is where you connect the uh, USB cable. All right. That's it. Very simple. That's probably why it's so cheap. I'm not sure what this ring is for. Oh, okay, I see. So this does not connect directly here because of the cable. So I guess you'd thread this through here. Mm. It's weird because now pointing towards the back. I don't like that. Maybe it doesn't matter if you bend it like this. I would assume this is going to make things very lopsided. Let's see. I guess you don't have to put this one all the way in. You can just leave it a little bit loose. So, that's like this. Plug this in. It is not. Oh, there it goes. 
See, now, now it's very back heavy. So, let's see if there's anything in here that's worth reading, has a sensitivity, all this stuff. Coracoid, um, makes no sense to me. Has a volume knob, and I guess if you turn it all the way, it just turns it off. Even though there's no clicking. I'll have to check with that. And this is the pattern, but it doesn't tell you like where the front is. Like, is that the pattern coming out from this, this side or the back? Polar response. The power. Click on sound preferences. All right. Well, the true test will be comparison, right? So maybe I'll do like a, a short comparison, and then you can tell me what you think. Uh, and then I'll play with it some more, and we'll see if. Uh, it was worth it or not. Hopefully it is. Thanks for watching. And uh, stay tuned for the samples. Okay, I'm going to read a Robert Frost poem using the built-in microphone on the iMac and then moving to the white headsets that come with the iPhones and that has the microphone built in. And then I'm going to do two recordings with the Pi painting uh, microphone, one directly from the top, which is not recommended, and then facing the volume knob, which is recommended by the uh, instructions. And then I want you to hear the difference. Uh, when I do go to the last uh, set of the poem uh, facing the microphone, it will be at full volume, uh, which when I'm talking directly from the top, which is the third part of the poem, it will not be at full volume, it will be 50% volume. And you're going to notice there's not that much of a difference. So uh, let's get to it. Two roads diverge in a yellow wood. And sorry I could not travel both. And be one traveler, long I stood. And looked down one as far as I could. To where it bent in the undergrowth. Then took the other as just as fair, and having perhaps the better claim, because it was grassy and wanted wear. Though as for that, the passing there had warned them really about the same. And both that morning equally lay, in leaves no step had trottled black. Oh, I kept the first for another day, yet knowing how way leads on to way, I doubt if I should ever come back. I shall be telling this with a sigh, somewhere ages and ages hence. Two roads diverged in a wood, and I, I took the one less traveled by, and that has made all the difference. Well, there you have it. I'm actually not very impressed with this mic at all. At full volume, both on the iMac and on the knob, it is not recording as well as what I expect. But then again, I don't know what to expect because this is my first external uh, USB mic. So I think what I'll do is order another one that is more mainstream, I guess, not an off brand and then compare it and uh, see which one I'll keep and which one I will get rid of or return. Uh, all right. Thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you.